I have a number of haters on YouTube, and I look at this. The minute I will upload a new video, I would always get the same people. Like, I don't even how know how this works. Because the minute I upload a new video, my team uploads a new video, I will always get the whatever, three or five or 10 thumbs down. Like the minute, every day, they would post negative comments, we block it out, but I know they're in there. So they don't like you, but they watch all your stuff every day and they interact with your content the minute you post something and they post a comment consistently for months, but they hate your guts though. I guess that, I guess that makes them a fan. Wouldn't you say? That makes them a fan. They're spending an awful lot of time hating, right? A lot of, a lot of time hating. Write it down. How people see you has got nothing to do with you. How people see you has got nothing to do with you. It has everything to do with them. Because isn't it true? You can post one article and some people will say, this is a phenomenal piece of content. This is awesome. This is life-changing. Same piece of article. Some people would say, this is a piece of shit. This is garbage. You just wasted two minutes of my life reading this post. Are you looking at the same post? How could it be? How could it the same post, two different people watch, like reading it, one says life-changing is phenomenal, one says a piece of shit. How could it be? Because it's got nothing to do with the post. It has to do with them, their upbringing, their belief system, their psychological makeup. Do this with me. Do this with me. Go ahead, put it in here. Go ahead. Do this. Every single one of us sees through life with a filter. Put it down. You are watching me, right? You are watching me. I'm communicating. I'm teaching. You hear completely something different, right? From you. And you hear something completely different from you. Because you don't hear a damn word I say. You hear what you want to hear. You hear what you want to hear. You hear, oh, that makes sense for my business. I'll take that in, right? Oh, no, no, I totally disagree with you. This doesn't make sense at all. So I don't hear you. You hear what you want to hear. You don't hear what I say. So we all have a filter. So when you post content on social media, knowing that you get haters, not because they hate you, and usually the people who hate other people the most, guess what? They hate themselves. They don't hate you. They hate themselves. Usually nameless, faceless. No name. Why? Why no name? Because they're hiding. They don't want people to see. They don't want people, you don't want people to know who they are. That's why they hide. I don't hide. You see me, you see my wife, you know what my wife looks like. You know what my house looks like. What car I drive. Yeah, people know what car I drive. What watch I wear. Doesn't get more trans... Uh, the, the thing they don't is what, you know, what underwear brand that I wear. You know? Depends on where I am. Yeah. You know? At home, maybe it's like just naked. Who knows? <laughs> right? So, yeah. But you know, see what I'm talking about? This is very powerful because when you are... When you have a strong personal brand, the key is it helps you to do all the pre-selling. Write it down. Personal brand equals pre-selling. It's not about having a fancy name, a fancy picture, all that stuff. No. It's by the time they interact, they get to you, they know you, like you, and trust you. You do not have to spend time. They know you already. They know your story. They know what you're about. So instead of spending all the time, usually one-on-one -on -one, to build up that trust, right? To meet someone. How many of you, have, you know, ever have experienced this? You meet someone, a stranger, a recommendation, right? Okay, let's go to lunch. You get to know this person. They get to know you, right? And then from there, you spend a lot of time, right? Networking. How many of you have done networking before? Yes, right? Traditional networking. Personal branding on social media, same. It's networking, but on steroids. It's accelerated. So instead of one-on-one -on -one with 10 people, why not have one to one million? 
They consume content. They want to. They want to get to know you at their own pace. They can watch one video. They can watch ten videos. <laughs>